Yesterday, President Trump declared meat processing plants critical infrastructure, meaning those plants can stay open and operate amid the pandemic. This is an effort to prevent a meat shortage, something many of us have been concerned about. Stephanie Sharp spoke with the Arkansas Cattlemen's Association, who tell us there won't be a food shortage, but there will likely be disruptions. COVID-19 has impacted people on several levels, including cattle farmers and livestock farmers like you see here. There has been a disruption in the supply chain. However, experts tell us that there is enough food to go around. Arkansas livestock farmers are still hard at work, especially right now. It's the middle of calving season, but during this time, many producers are keeping their eye on the bigger picture. We're hearing concern from a lot of our, from the cattle producers in Arkansas. Going from farm to table, the product needs to go through many different avenues. Cody Burkham is the Arkansas Cattlemen's Association Executive Vice President. He says there is a backlog when farmers can take their livestock to a processing facility. We've got to be able to, to move our cattle uh, further along in the process and right now there's a bottleneck in our supply chain that's really causing a lot of issues and some concern for our producers. Despite the backup, he reassures families the food supply isn't going anywhere. As we see these process facilities kind of slow or uh, you might not be able to find your favorite package of steak or your favorite cut of beef, but you there will still be plenty of product there. We do not have a food shortage in this country. We just have uh, some slowdown in our ability to deliver that product because it does require processing. Arkansas Farm Bureau Federation says there is limited capabilities with processing plants and it will take time to get back up to speed. It will be several months at least before we can get some kind of stability here in these markets. He agrees it's just another tough time for farmers, but they're having to adjust just like everyone else. Production capability in this country is huge. Uh, it's just a matter of getting to get it processed and delivered in the right place. The Arkansas Cattlemen's Association says it's working with farmers across the state to get a portion of the CARES Act. However, there will be a financial loss. What that loss is is unknown at this time. In Faulkner County, I'm Stephanie Sharp.